Hey racers, welcome to the channel Race to Win. Version 0.8.77 is out. Let's go through all the new changes in this update. New cars are in dealership. We have the Mazda MX-5 Miata. And in crates, there is a Mazda MX-5 Miata RF Hardtop Edition. Another crate car is the K truck. Available in the 950 gold crate. I got it but it took 50,000 gold worth of rage to get it. It has potential with its 710 kg weight. The Yen achievement is finally available. You take the youth and do a burnout by installing rear wheel drive drive train in it. Press gas and brake at the same time and that's it. Free contraband car, the Holden Commodore Day, a V8 supercar edition, livery looks sick and it's a decent car. And we get a contraband intercooler. Nice. Police chasers are back. You tap a cop and run. And this is the end screen after losing the cops. Interesting. Speaking of interesting, new loading screen art for the D Evolution event has appeared. Featuring two Teslas and a V8 engine. These are electric cars and let us hope that the event will be well received and the engine swaps perfectly. New performance parts are available now in the shop. Intake category has these new blowers, filters for your engine, 30 horsepower which is the same as HKX Ultramel intake making all of them the best parts for intake. Purchase it and equip it to see the visual changes. It is obvious that it appears for front engine cars and doesn't look that good in mid engine cars obviously gonna look good in muzzle cars though the most important thing is the car ranking reset everything has changed mainly reduced like reaching x class needs only thousand car rank points it is a good thing to be honest people can beat the borealis event with an r2 car easily so that was it regarding the update let me know in the comments if i have missed any new things Consider subscribing to the channel for more Apex Racer content and keep racing.